Hi guys, let me get my camera settings and all done. Stop the shaky. Zoom in. Okay, let's see here. Let's brighten that up. One minute, guys. Let's get this. That looks pretty good. Might have to change it. Hi, Kenny. Can you hear me? Pacola, Julie, Veronica, pussyfooting with Holly. <laughs> oh, you guys. All right. So uh, I, I thought maybe I might make some art cards. Um, maybe draw some on the, okay, why is that? Wait, 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 wait. Uh, maybe draw some, um, something on this art scrolls. So right now I'm just painting some cards. The background's black while I say good morning, you know. So good morning, everybody. Hi, Riri. Hi, Susie, Tammy, Kimberly. Hi. Oh, there's Terry. Wait, wait. Where's where's my, uh, let me get my soundboard here. <laughs> Good to have you back, Terry. I hope you're getting some sleep. Um, I know I have, I know I have, uh, hang on, where is it? No, it's here. Hang on, guys. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, oh, here we go. Here's my other Terry. mask <laughs> oh, oh you're welcome mark let me go ahead and tweet guys hang on i gotta forgot about that so many pre pre things to do <laughs> you're welcome terry <laughs> hi jerry veronica great hang on guys let me tweet <clears throat> coffee and art in the morning Live. <laughs> Hang on. Let's see. Link in profile. Coffee and I always say morning. It always comes out morning. Coffee and art in the morning. Did I get my water heater? No, I. It's all, it has. It had to be ordered. Coffee and art in the morning. Um, it won't be here till like the first week in February. That's <laughs> how long it takes to, to get it in ordered. So, and then we got to set up somebody to come and put it in, install it. So, yeah, no, it's not here. <laughs> we, we bought it. Let's put it that way. We bought the water heater, but it's not here yet. Won't be here till the first week of February. Hi, Mitz. Uh, Ro, Ro, hi, Ro. Who else? Artsy. Hi, Mary. Mary, I don't know if you saw. You probably weren't here around. Um, you do those morning early shows now, even before I get, well, not before I get up, but before I get on. Um, did you, Vonnie, you know, Vaughn, she sent me those uh, two Shakespeare little tapestry cloth things. Here, I'll show you mine. Make sure I have any paint on me. Anyway, um, Vonnie sent me two of these, Mary. They're like duck cloth, Shakespeare. And when I saw your journal, 
your art journal where you had a Shakespeare. So I sent you the second one of these so that you should be getting. There's no mail today, guys. I forgot today. There's no mail today. But anyway, Mary, I sent you one of these <laughs> from Vonnie. Um, yeah. Hi, Leah. I'm sure I'm missing Bridget. Let's have my phone while I'm at work. Well, oh, 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 sorry, Bridget. Shh, shh, shh. That should be on the DL, right? <laughs> um, so I'm just painting. It doesn't matter if paint gets on the back because the backside gets painted black eventually as well. <clears throat> so, yeah. So I'm just painting all these cards to start with. This is going to be the background for the art cards. I have These are postcard size art cards. I usually, my postcards are usually three by four. Hi, Susan. But I decided to make these a little bigger. And I just have a kind of a vision in my head of what I want them to be. So, uh, yeah, we'll see. <laughs> um, I thought about doing a circus theme. Uh, and I still might end up going with some circus ones, too. But then with the um, moon, the lunar eclipse last night, I said, well, I'm going to try to do something with the lunar eclipse. So I'm going to try to do some lunar cards. <clears throat> Hi, Sammy. Hi, Nick and Tina, Kimberly, Darla. So, yeah, for those watching the recording, I do like to say good morning to everybody for a few minutes. Um, my schedule time is not till 9, so I usually come on about 8.30. So if you don't want to watch chit-chat and hellos, just fast forward. No big deal. Just fast forward. Or better yet, try to come in on one of the live shows and chat with us. <laughs> Oh, come in and chat with us. Did anybody see? Um, hi, Louise. Hi, Frana. Tammy. Hey, Dev. How you doing? Um, so anyway, I watched. Uh, I watched the eclipse on the on the Griffith Observatory in L.A. I mean, I wasn't there. <laughs> but I mean, I watched it on their stream and I did tweet it out. So hopefully some other people got to, I mean, it was all over. It was streamed everywhere on different, different places by different people. But anyway, it was really cool. So I did take a screenshot from the observatory's uh, stream. So I have something to work with here. <laughs> Hi, Kenny. Who else am I missing? Now, I hope Kenny and Melody both are feeling better. I, don't, I haven't seen Melody. Of course, I didn't, I wasn't uh, um, around a lot on the over the weekend. So I didn't uh, have errands and things to do. So I did get a lot of happy mail out and, and some people have already got it. <clears throat> There's no mail today in the States for Martin Luther King Day. Yeah, yeah, it was so cool close up. I'll show you all the pictures, uh, well, the picture I took. I took one screenshot. I mean, everybody's probably seen it by now. Um, big, the big orange moon. So anyway, I don't, I'm just gonna go ahead and paint all these while I'm out. I don't know that I'm gonna make this many, but <laughs> I might as well use up this black paint. Hi, newbie, Cheryl. <laughs> Yeah, I, I do move kind of quick and uh, I, I try to explain things as I'm going because I know when I'm going fast. But, you know, I always I think, too, when I'm doing projects, you know, uh, it's literally people have to sit and watch paint dry. <laughs> I try. I try to move along. So I drive 300 miles through the night to work away and get to my usual hotel. They forgot to book me. And so I had to drive all the way back home. They apologize and get, oh, well, good. You can get a lot. Yeah, you can stream a lot of days in, the, in a week or a lot of times in a week, Dev. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was, I bet that was a long drive, though. Wasn't it like five hours one way, Dev? Don't you have to drive like five hours one way? <laughs> oh, my gosh. So you like drove 10 hours. You probably need a nap. Do like Jean does, nap in my stream, Dev. Just nap in my stream. <laughs> oh, my God. Because I think you drive. Don't you drive like five or six hours one way? For those that don't know, Dev is the modernist colorist. He has the awesomest man cave ever. <laughs> oh, 
Hi, Seely. I'm trying to see what else is going on. Yeah, four hours plus each way. Okay, yeah. Eight hours. That's a lot. That's eight, ten hour drive. They should give you all that time off. <laughs> uh, yeah, you have to just take a nap, Deb, and do some streaming. Well, you might be off work, but we're not letting you off of streaming. You, you know. <laughs> We'll crack that whip, Deb. Crack, crack that whip. Get some coloring out of you. <laughs> um. <clears throat> I think the longest I ever drove by myself one way was 16 hours to San Antonio from Georgia. And uh, I did it twice there and back. And don't recommend it. I was a little bit younger. I don't think I'd do it. Well, I know I wouldn't do it now. I wouldn't go by myself now. But back, you know, a little younger, a little braver, you know. Yeah, let's just let's just drive to San Antonio. 16 hours. Okay. Uh, hi, D39. Patricia. Hi, Diana. <laughs> you like that? You like my sound effects, Terry? <laughs> oh, there was something else. Oh, um, oh, I, yeah, I know what it was. Who was it last week that uh, when we said, uh, and I put it in the, I think it was Holly D. Holly D said, um, when I asked about what guild you'd like to be in, if you were back in the guild days, and she said the lollipop guild. Oh, my gosh. I should have so sung. We all, let's, how's it go? We want to wish. No, let's see. How's it go? I got I'm trying to do the lollipop guild, but I can't. I can't think of the words of the song now. We want to. Oh God, what is it? Because I can do the voice now. I can do the voice and can't remember the words. What are the words? We represent. Yeah. Thank you, Terry. Oh, Terry's. Terry is in no. In no way will she let me get away from embarrassing myself. So she'll put the words in there and make me uh, karaoke. <laughs> we represent the lollipop guild. The lollipop guild. The lollipop guild. Okay, but not, that's probably all I can get away without a copyright. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, you changed your name, Holly. Why'd you change your name? Why'd you change your nickname? Hi, Nanamo. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Too much fun for a Monday. Okay, so I'm just painting all these cards. And, again, I don't care if it gets on the back because the backs are going to be painted black, too. And uh, and this is just a big poster board here, here that I'm working on. <clears throat> Love it in this morning. <laughs> oh my goodness hi carrie v uh who else am i missing i'm sure i'm missing some people guys don't don't think i'm ignoring you i do have to look away from chat i have to look away from chat every now and then to do something <laughs> it's just painting black cards for background okay let's pick up some of that excess paint there Okay, um, I think I should probably go wash this brush. If I put it in my um, tub of water over here, it's just going to make my whole all my water get muddy. So I think I should probably go wash it. Yeah, there you go, Marcus. And let's see. Now, see, now I can't do it, Mark. <laughs> and Mark put the words, and in the name of the Lollipop Guild, we we like. Oh, I can't do it now, Mark. It's out of my head. Oh my gosh. We represent the lollipop guild, the lollipop guild. And then it goes, I'm looking for marks. <laughs> and in the name of the lollipop guild, we like to welcome you to Munchkin Land. <laughs> okay, have I properly embarrassed myself for the morning? <laughs> Somebody just coming in, we're going, what the heck? <laughs> nice high note. Thanks, Terry. Okay, let me go real quick, wash my brush out and grab some coffee. So let's see, what do we got? None will have happy mail, hurting cats. 
Andy says BRB. Where's Andy? Okay, there. I don't want his little hair in the paint. There we go. All right, give me a, give me just a minute, guys, to grab some coffee and wash this brush. Hang on. <laughs> You can open the garage. It's okay. Usher goes, you know, I gotta open the garage. I said, don't worry, they're used to it. They're used to listening to the garage door open. I told him I sang the Lollipop Guild song. He goes, You're not gonna do the curly shuffle too, are you? Uh, I said, No, no curly shuffle. Do y'all know what the curly shuffle is? Let me dry this and then I'll tell you. <laughs> Just so my hands are not sitting in the. Hi, Gil. Gil, um, Enrique. Enrique, can we just call you Enrique? Hi, Weedy. I'm sure I'm missing somebody. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah. yeah. But you got to do the curly shuffle with it. Have y'all ever seen Curly do the curly shuffle? Where he lays down on his side and goes, whoa, 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 and spins around on the floor. Have y'all seen that? I can do that. <laughs> I'm sure some of you are not shocked. <laughs> Someone actually um, uh, challenged me or dared me to do the curly shuffle at work one time. Now, this was like years ago, probably maybe 30 years ago. <laughs> Someone challenged me to do the curly shuffle at work. So, yeah, in the middle of work, I, I went, whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> You want to sing it? I'm sure you do. I'm sure you do, great. <laughs> okay, well, it's still a little damp there, I can see. Let me get, where's my baby? Well, this was a baby one. <clears throat> so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I know you need to see it, Sammy, but I'm not, I'm not rearranging the camera today. <laughs> nice try. Okay, so let me dry that again. I just want to get that excess paint there from when I did those cards. <laughs> I know we were going to make some art cards and then... I also pulled out an, the art scroll. I th I'm thinking about doing drawing some animals. But I wanted to just do a, and again, I'm not going to do this many. I just cut a whole bunch of uh, cardstock up to uh, work on uh, some little art cards based on the lunar eclipse. I got to turn that heater down now. I got a sweater shirt on today. It's kind of toasty. Moving around, my I can keep myself warm just by moving around the studio. <laughs> Who needs a heater? <laughs> Curly shuffle catch up, Zeely. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and again, I don't care if paint gets on the back because the back is going to be painted black eventually too. If y'all haven't seen, I guess I should pull out some of my art cards to show. So yeah, we'll do a little. Let me catch my breath moment. <clears throat> And I know you will hear the garage open and closing. Yeah. Um, right up my alley, Dee Dee. The eclipse capture. <laughs> yeah. So the first thing I think I'm going to do, let me see if I can 
It's um, let me get uh, some of my cards here that are up here on the shelf. Let's see if I can. Oh, I've got to go turn that heat down, guys. I need, I don't know if Hubster's already at gone. Uh oh, I gotta turn that heater down. Hang on. Okay. Oh, get my exercise running up and down those stairs. Alrighty. <clears throat> Alrighty. Let's see. Couldn't see the eclipse. Okay. Well, let me first off, let me show you the picture that I took just right off the uh, way off the stream live show live stream. Oh, it's not in the mail. Oh, I'm hot, hot to hot. I just leave my door open, but the cats want to get up here in the paint. So here's the picture. Here's the picture. Oh, let me turn the light down, I think. Turn the light down just a little. So it shows up on camera. What? No, 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 no. I want photos. There we go. Okay, so here, uh, it's not going to show, guys. It's just going to reflect. Sorry, it's not going to show up. Maybe I could get it on my phone. <clears throat> Hang on. Oh, my gosh, hot. Might have to go change shirts. This sweater is not going to do it. Um, Hang on, let's see. Where is it? Okay, here we go. Here we go. I'll show you on my phone. Let me turn the light down on the phone. Okay. Okay, so here, here's the picture that they, this was live last night. Oh my gosh, such a reflection. Anyway, it's flipped over already. Flip back. There we go. So there's the... Um, well, with, with my camera reflection. Anyway, I got a good picture off of the website. Hi, Eileen. Did I receive the happy mail? Oh, you're welcome. Oh, you're welcome, Dev. You're welcome. I thought you would like that. <laughs> okay, let's see. You're welcome. <clears throat> yeah, I sent out a bunch of happy mail. So hopefully, um, yeah, but there's no mail today, guys. It's, oh, uh, Hang on, guys. I'm, my chair is all. I sit on a nice, cozy blanket, and it's moving around. There we go. There we go. Okay, my squeaky chair, but it's so comfortable. Okay, so um, yeah. So let me go look through some of my art cards here. These are not my postcards, though. These are just the small ones. Where's my postcards? What do I do with those? Oh, they're up here. Um, let's look up here. Uh, Okay, so let's look in this batch. Here we go. So this is some of my, uh, these are older. These are from 2000. This one's from 2014 anyway. Um, so these are some of the art cards that I've made. These are the these are the postcard size ones. But my standard ones, my standard cards are, um, do I have, these are in process, I think are three by four. These are the standard size. Why is my camera? Okay, hang on. All right. My standard size. Oh, good, G. You have to show them. Do you have them? You have... And good morning, by the way, sassy pants. <clears throat> yeah, so these are some of the ones that I've done over the years. Um three by four size. So he, there's, there's just a few of them. There's all, you know, i got tons of them. Some are in different process, different um, stages, I should say. But anyway, today I'm going to do um, the postcard size ones. Here's some tiny ones I've done. These are, uh, how size are these? They're more, I think they're, more than an inch, I thought. Here, let me get one. Of 
They're two inches. Yeah, they're two inches. These are two inch squares. I haven't done any of these in a long time because they're they're really tiny, tiny on the eyes. It's upside down. So you can see. Okay, Jean. Okay. Oh, these are upside down. So these are little two inch art cards that I've done. And there's just all kinds of sizes, right? Even done them on uh, the Rolodex cards. So I have a bunch of them done on Rolodex cards. Little tiny people over there. So, yeah. All different kinds of uh, sizes of cards. <clears throat> Alrighty. So, let's put this back up on the shelf. Hi, Kim. Dawn. Maxie. Okay, Deb. Yeah, I just got me a cup myself. All right, guys. There we go. All right. <clears throat> so... This is just a 90 weight card stock, which will be, it'll be um, thicker feeling after it's got paint and paint on both sides. And let's see, let's uh, brighten this up just a little. There we go. There we go. And maybe a little zoom in. So I wanted to do a little bit on these cards. And then I also wanted to do... Um, might draw on the uh, might draw on the uh, art scroll. Okay, there we go. Sorry, guys, I'm messing with all the settings to try to get it as clear as possible because my camera's fighting black and white. <laughs> it's going. I don't like to do that. All right, so Lisa, who else is here? I'm trying. AJ. So thanks everybody for being here. Okay, I'm gonna probably have to let's turn this over. I got a stack of paper here, so there we go. All right. <clears throat> Still looks a little, I guess it's because I'm so zoomed in, but we'll we'll deal. We'll deal. Hi, Janet. How you doing? Oh, and that reminds me, Jan, I got to get with you on Scooby sent us both an email on dubious documents, and I have not had time to, uh, I've not had time to go over that yet. Okay. Hang on, guys. Where's the... Okay. Eh, eh that'll do. Hi, Noodle. Okay, so, hey, Melody to Melody. Come and hope you're doing better. Yeah, I've had a busy weekend and a lot of errands and things to do. And then uh, we, we got messed up today being a holiday. <laughs> All right, so it got dark again. So the, the my camera is not liking the um, fighting the black and the white here. I think I'm gonna have to zoom back out a little. That's that's what it is. It's fighting the the zoom. Uh, yeah, yeah. I gotta call you, Janet, so we can do that to Scooby's uh, dubious document question. It's Martin Luther King Day. Um, uh, in the States, Gene. So there's, you know, a federal holiday, no post, no mail. So, yeah. Um, yeah, you, if y'all want to talk to uh, Holly, you better just call her Holly or you will continuously be, um, you will continuously be muted because of her name. Uh, you'll be muted every time you say her name. So, uh, yeah. And Michelle, we will, we all can check your channel out just by going to your name. You don't have to, you don't have to post a thing there. You can't post links anyway. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, um, again, what I wanted to do was, let me see if I can find my template here for some moon and earth. So let's just start with one. And I think, well, no, I think I'll start with two because I'm going to try to do one vertical and one horizontal. So we'll see how this goes. And where's my light? Oh, my, my light went out. There we go. No wonder. It was, I must have bumped my light when I 
got up there on the card. There we go. That's a little better. Yeah, my ring light was off. <laughs> no, that was, was a little weird. What, what's going on with my light? It was my ring light was off. <clears throat> okay, so what I want to do is let me get a white pencil here. Oh, and then the other thing I got out, like I said, I got out my art scroll so we can maybe draw some things after a while. Maybe some animals or something. All right, let's just get a white pencil, a sharpener. So we're going to just have some Monday fun. Monday art fun. And what for that? Okay, so I'm thinking on, I want to have the earth, and I should probably, maybe I should have a little bigger earth. Hmm. Is this bigger? Yeah, that's bigger. Do I want it that big? Man, yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's just go with, let's try that size earth. And that's a little little. Still needs to be a little bigger. <clears throat> Here we go. So I'm thinking I want the earth that big. And then the moon. I kind of want it pretty symmetrical. Well, maybe I'll do it a little off to the side. Let's try this. This is all, I'm just winging this, guys. Yeah, it's not a stencil. Um, it's a template, a template, 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 however you want to say it. Yeah. You can get all kinds of cool templates in the uh, drafting section of Michael's Hobby Lobby. They, they won't be over in the stencils. They'll be in drafting. <clears throat> Okay, so that size, and then this one I'll do a bit smaller earth, and then a bigger moon maybe on this one. Something like this. Okay, so those two sizes. Emma is obsessed by the moon. When I babysit, we have to look for it. Oh, that's cute. Hi, Susie Coloring, by the way. Hi, Nanamo. I know I'm missing. Um, yeah. I, I don't know how, uh, what the, what the, I thought you had to be uh, 16. How old do you have to be to be on YouTube? I don't remember. <laughs> it's been so long since I've been that age. Uh Okay, so what I want to do, I'm going to start with these two, and um, and we'll see how it goes. Oh, if y'all see Robin Loves Reading, I just saw something in my room that if she comes in. Oh, th you just got to be 13? Okay, well, you got to be 13 to be here, Michelle. Yeah. So, yeah, you might have to, I don't want to, I hate to say I have to kick you, but uh, yeah, if you have to be 13. All right, let's see. Yeah, come on in, honey. What's up? You getting ready to leave? Okay. All right, so let's move this out of the way. Okay. Yeah. All right, honey. See you later. Uh, let's see. Do I want to start with... Or, let's see. Let me get this tray back. I'm going to need this for painting. Thanks, guys. Bye, Michelle. All right. Let's see. All right. Put a little orange for the moon. That should probably be enough. Let me get another paintbrush. <clears throat> and where's my picture of the moon? Let's start with the moon. Now, you know what? I probably should start with a bucket of stars. It's probably what I should start with. Um, I need a little white there, too. 
All righty, a little bit of white, and I still have the black if I need that left over. Oh, 13. Well, not if but 13 is not too young for our channel, Jean. I mean, for this this place, we're pretty family friendly here. I mean, you know, every now and then we let something slip, but it's pretty family friendly here. All right, let's see. Um, need a little my little juice lids here to put uh, some watered down white. So I'm gonna put a little bit of white in there. Get a floppy brush. Um, yeah, yeah, it, yeah. We it, we're usually pretty friendly here, but I don't, you know, I want the rules to be, you know, if if YouTube says 13, then please be 13. If you're like in chat, if you're watching with your mom or grandmother or whatever, well, that's you know, you can. That's different. Okay, so let's see. I'm gonna go ahead and. Let's go ahead and put some stars down here. I might as well just go ahead and do a lot of them while I have this right here. Let's just go ahead and do, let's go ahead and splatter these and I'll throw them on the floor down here behind me. <clears throat> a little more water. It's a little thick still. So let me go ahead and do this real quick. So if we make more. They can be they can be drying over here on the side. Oh yeah, in general, yeah, exactly, Jean. In general, yeah. all righty. Can always add more. Always paint over it. Sorry, guys, for all the squeaky chair and jiggly camera, but I'm trying. I'm trying not to bump the table where I'm. Uh, the camera table oh you like how i splat well look just be aware don't do it too close to the laptop or your screen whatever your or, or your camera or whatever so again mixed media day so we'll do some art cards maybe some drawing i didn't get to make any coloring catch-ups over the weekend but we'll we'll uh, we'll catch up we'll get some stuff done <laughs> never fear how are the are you, you no it's not a quill it's uh it's one of the japanese calligraphy brushes very flop you need a floppy brush it doesn't have to be one of these japanese calligraphy brushes but it needs to be a floppy brush <clears throat> And it does go a lot of play. It does splatter, so you got to be careful. Um, <laughs> you, you, you're acceptable to um, stars, Jean, being splattered. Yeah. I didn't realize I'd made so many this morning. So I just painted some 90 weight. I think it's 90 weight. It could be 110. Anyway, whatever you got, 90, 110. <laughs> Is it possible to leave here the link with my coloring book? On? No, uh, Pokemon, it's not. Um, for one, even, I don't even think the mods can put direct Etsy links. So no, you can tell, if you want to tell us the name of your Etsy shop, you can type in the name of your Etsy shop. But you can't put a link. So yeah. All righty, there we go. <clears throat> All right. And only mods can put direct links, guys, in case y'all didn't know that. All right, clean that brush. Let's move the bucket of stars. Let me get a baby wipe here. No Etsy linking, yeah. I didn't, I, and I don't know why. I mean, is Etsy in, in a competition with YouTube or so, Google? I'm not sure. Why they don't. They like to put Amazon links. Yeah, they like to put Amazon. All right, let me get another baby wipe here. All righty. 
the other thing I wanted to do, and I might do this on its own video, is show my dilution. Because I get, I always get questions on the things I use, what, I, how I make my dil dilutions. Not altered, not abandoned altered books, but just regular uh, collage mixed media in my dilution books. You know, let me show you. <clears throat> In these dilution books, how I do my dilutions, um, collage mixed media from scratch, just from a blank page. So I might do a recording of just a flip through of these because a lot of times when I show this stuff, guys, I show it in the middle of a stream and then I get questions. Well, how do you do your dilutions? How do you do your mixed media? Well, it was in the middle of so and so stream, right? So, um, I think what I'll do is a um, a video just flipping through my four or five, however many I got four of them. <coughs> how to how to work in the dilutions uh, books and some of them like this one's my newer one, but here I'll just show you a page out of it here. So these all start from scratch. There's nothing, no base to these. These just start off with a blank page. So I think what I'll do is make video just on that. Okay. Separate, separate video. Okay. So let's bring these two back here. Let's dry these. Make sure they're dry, I should say. Oh, thanks, AJ. Yeah. And I'll just do like a art journal question and answer, like what I use, all the supplies, which I've done before, but it's usually in the middle of a video, right? <clears throat> all right. So let's see. Let's start with, let me get my picture of my moon back. I'll try to get as close as I can. Um, I'll probably add a little more orange at this, at this stage of the picture that I took wasn't as... Oh, dark. It was around midnight last night. So, yeah, I went to bed later than my usual. Um, let's see. I'll turn this back up for myself. All right, so there's my moon pictures. There we go. Uh, yeah, <laughs> Terry, I know. I was up watching the uh, eclipse. Okay, so I'm going to start with just basing in the moon. So let's get my, I'm going to do it orange. It was actually not a red moon. It was orange. So I'm just, and remember guys, this is a, this is a base of color pens. I mean, uh, a base of, uh, okay. I'm going to have to put black back on there because that's going to show through. I don't want that. Um, I don't want those stars showing through. So let me go back to my black here. Let's just go back and get rid of the, stars that I got on the here. So they don't show through. Remember guys, if you want to ask me anything, put it in caps. And I don't know what Janet and Eileen plan for today. What about you, Jean? What are you going to do? And I hope you're feeling better, by the way, Jean. I think you were kind of under the weather over the weekend. If I saw the tweets right. Oh, yeah, I was enabling with the new uh, Tim Holtz Ranger sprays, if that's what she's talking. Yeah, they're talking about all of them. <laughs> Oh, at creative, create, what's it called? Create vision now, create a vision. Shannon Green's out there uh, with her, um, oh, what's the name of her journals called? You don't know what you're doing yet, Janet? Yeah, creativation, creativation, yeah. Okay. Oh, so anyway, what I was starting to say is, the black paint is, or any acrylic paint, acrylic paint is perfect to pencil on top of. 
you know, whether it's an art, you know, project like this or in your um, color books. Let's see, a little bit more. Maybe a little. There's my blue. Didn't I squeeze out? I guess I didn't squeeze out the blue. I've got a baby wipe. We'll put the baby wipes here. And uh, yeah, so Shannon has got. Um, whoops. She has a booth out there. Gina's going to use Judy. <laughs> she is not. Is she really, Eileen? Eileen, don't be tricking me. <laughs> oh, Eileen, you're bad. <laughs> you got to kind of turn it so I can get a nice edge here. <laughs> you're bad, Eileen. <laughs> I'm going to lay with embossing powders and UT and no dyes. Oh, are you really going to use UT then? Oh, my gosh. She's not She's not tricking me, is she? I, I, I mean, uh, Jean. <laughs> so I want to make a, I want to make a mess of these here art cards. I want to make a mess of them. So I might be doing some, I might give some of these away. <laughs> she is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You guys, I swear. So as the paint is drying, I'm able to add more layers to it. Oops. Orange and white. Almost use a little yellow instead of white. The yellow is going to mute it. Let's see. <clears throat> okay. Am I zoomed in enough, guys, for y'all to see what's going on here? I can try to zoom in a little. You're going to lay with embossing powders and UT, but no dyes. <laughs> yeah, keep those dyes away from me, Jean. We'll have them in a, we'll have them in a disarray. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just painting the moon here. It got a little out of lines. That's okay. We can just go back with paint or pencil. I don't really want to put a uh, pencil around this yet because I'm going to put a little bit of a glow. Thanks, Kenny. Yeah, thanks. <clears throat> and I'm just cleaning my brush off on a baby wipe here. And it's, it's really a jacked up brush. Look, can you see that? Look at that brush. So this is a good scruffy brush. It's a good brush to make scruffy marks. So yeah. <laughs> That's why you see me have, I have a lot of brushes. A lot of them look like this. And none of my brushes except my oil brushes that are put away in a, in a wrap. Um, you know, one of those wraps. Other than those, these are all just craft brushes. Nothing expensive. Okay. 
Okay, something like this. You make it look so easy. Jacked up brushes and all. <laughs> Thanks, Riri. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, so I need a little bit more dark on this side here. Let's put a little orange in that. Not too much though, because depending on what time, whoops, I got that white in there. Depending on what time you saw it. Something like that. Oh, thank you, Sammy. Thank you. All right, a little more orange and yellow. Right, we're here. Something like this. Maybe a little bit more yellow. I probably have to let this dry before that yellow is going to show as a layer. Yeah, something like that. What do y'all think? How's that look? Hi, Scoops. Scoops, we, uh, yeah, thanks, everybody. Yeah, thanks for the thumbs up. Yeah, everybody give me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Thanks for the reminder, Scoops. <laughs> uh And me and Janet are going to get together and go over your email, Scooby. Okay, something like that. I think that's pretty good. All right, so I got to do another one just like it. <laughs> I got to do, I got one, two, three, I got three, six, nine to 12. I got 15, 20, 15 or 18 of them to do. <laughs> Not going to do them all here, guys, for you. I'm only going to do two. <laughs> so now I just got to duplicate that one. Similar anyway, it'll have to duplicate it exactly, but because you know it could have happened. Uh, you know, I painted them at two different uh intervals of the eclipse, right? <laughs> um, and then also, guys, I'm gonna put pencil on, it's gonna even be brighter. As soon as that dries, you're going to wait. Wait till that you see that pop out. Okay, this is just the, uh, whoops, this is just the um, first layer here. We gotta, then we got to draw the earth. <laughs> uh, hi, Sabrina. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. You got your card. Good. So what's everybody else working on these days or today, today or over the weekend? What'd y'all do? Anything? Anything fun? I hope. So I guess y'all saw who won the playoffs uh, in because the Super Bowl is going to be held here in Atlanta at the Mercedes Benz Stadium. We were hoping that the Falcons would be there in the first year of the uh, stadium, but no, 
It's not, <laughs> but the Super Bowl will be here. So, uh, yeah, I won't be doing much of anything uh, my birthday weekend because I'm not going downtown. And we usually go downtown and go to uh, the museum, Varsity, Blick. Yeah, that ain't happening. <laughs> that is not happening. I will be working on script lettering. Oh, Kathy, awesome. Are you gonna are you gonna do uh you will be or you did work on? A lot of y'all are working on the scavenger hunt for Janet's scavenger hunt. Janet, you can put the link in there, somebody can, to the link of uh, the list of the scavenger hunt. No two moons look alike, trust me. No, no two of these moons are going to look alike. <laughs> I'm cleaning my craft room. Day three. It stopped being fun days ago. <laughs> uh, my problem when I re redo, you know, move the things around in my craft room or my, you know, art space, studio, whatever you want to call it, is I, if, unless I take things out of the room, I don't have any place to move them to, to move the stuff to, right? And uh, so it's real tricky. It's real tricky to rearrange a room when you don't have any place to move things unless you get it out of the room. I'm going to work on today. It's part of the Wanderlust class. Oh, okay. The lettering is part of the Wanderlust class, Kathy. Okay. Thank you, Pacola. Pacola put in a link to the scavenger hunt. Um, I don't go downtown Charleston during, during, I'm not sure what that is. Spoleto, Elena? I'm not sure what that is. <clears throat> okay, a little bit more. Oh, there we go. Janet's got the video where she launches the original list. Okay. Thanks, Janet. Okay. So what do y'all think? How's this looking? Need a little bit more. Right in there, I think. Something like that. Okay, so there's our moon for now. Now, again, you got to wait for it. There's going to be some nice accents on this. Nice accents. I need a little bit more orange on this one, I think. I need a little more orange over here. I need a little bit more orange. And then a little bit more yellow right there. They look fabulous. Oh, thank you. Okay, well, they're gonna I'm gonna have some more touches to them. All right, now I gotta find um, let me see, where's my pictures of my moon? I mean my earth. Let's see, do I have one here? Where's my found some earth pictures? Um all right, so I want a little bit of the dark side. I'm going to have a light glow over on this side. Okay, so I'm going to need a different color of blue. That. And of course, I got my black here. Let me pull some of this black over here. 
just so I have it handy. And let me get a fresh baby wipe because that's why I'm cleaning my brush as I go. Okay. I can try to zoom in a little. We can, we can, unless this looks, I mean, this looks pretty good as far as overall picture. Let's turn the camera down this way just a little. Hang on, guys. It's adjusted here. So I'm in, I can get in there easy. <clears throat> All right, let's see here. All right, let's go ahead and start with, um, Mix a nice blue here. Look at this little tiny space I'm using right there. I'm just gonna mix the I'm gonna mix the blue for the world right there. <laughs> All right, let me just get a base on here. Get a base for the earth. Okay. Oh, thanks, Deb. Uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm just winging it, guys. I'm just, you know, just looking at some reference materials of the moon from last night and a, you know, picture of the Earth from space, and we'll see what we can do with it. With my scruffy little scruffy, jacked up brush. <laughs> And then we'll put some, maybe a little uh, something going on. I don't, don't want to detract too much from that. I mean, I could put a little bit of a glow and maybe a star or two. I don't know if I want to put a bunch of, maybe a far, far nebula, you know, because that's, you don't see that from the earth. You don't see those nebulas unless you're, you know, in a telescope. You're not going to see, um, you're not going to see nebulas from earth. Uh, so, yeah. All right. So if these turn out, I'll make a bunch more. All right, now, now let's see if I, let me look at a couple different pictures here, what part of Earth would be showing. Okay, oh, I'm going to probably need a little bit of green. Just a little green. A little bit of green, just, just a tad of green. There we go. That's going to be a little dark. I think I'm going to need a little bit of lime green in that just to knock it down a little. I don't know why I always pull the almost empty con containers out. I got full ones. I'm always pulling out the almost empty ones. All right. <clears throat> Let's do a little bit of green. I'm going to work on them both at the same time. Let me get in here. Okay. So there's going to be, and I'm, I'm imagining we're at, we're on North America here. Okay, North America's right in here. You can see maybe a little, on, on this one, because I've got over half the earth, you might see a little tiny bit of South America down here. I'm going to put some clouds, though, so it's going to be easy to disguise it. Okay, so let's put a little bit more. Just a little touch of, you know, some green there, maybe up here in Newfoundland. <laughs> Jean. <laughs> And then I'm going to need a little bit of tan. Let's see. Let's go with the let's go with yellow ochre here. Okay, this one's this one's clogged up. Let's go right over here. Whoa! <laughs> I did not need that much. I just want uh, um, essence of continents right essence of continents i'll have to knock that back i made that too big a little bit down here okay just a little bit you know because it's going to be covered up with clouds pretty much all right let's see
A little something going on up there. Nothing, you can't really see nothing down here. It's going to be a lot of clouds. All right. Oops. Uh-oh. Let's cover up that little, little mess. There's a wet spot on the earth. <laughs> so I'm going to make a couple of these guys, and then I'll probably do, uh, we're going to draw on the art scroll. Hi, Elena. It's just a mixed media day. All right, so now let's go ahead and go back to, see, it's not that high up. The, the It's not going to be that much showing, but I want you to be able to tell. You know, I want you to be able to tell that it's earth. So I'm going to fix that in a minute. Can't see anything down there. Essence of continents. Not not seeing a lot of nothing, much of nothing. <laughs> you like mixed media days, Kathy? Okay. All right, so I just want a little bit of that. Now I'm going to go in here with a little bit lighter blue. Let's mix this up a little lighter. Let's see what we can do here. going to have clouds and everything. This is just the base coat, the undercoat, the underpainting of the world. <laughs> We're underpainting the world. <laughs> uh, <laughs> We're underpainting the world. Okay, let's go back to this one. <clears throat> oh, oh, thank you, Forever Purple. Thank you. And anybody else I miss coming in, thanks, everybody, for being here. I thought it'd be fun just to have a mixed media day. Nothing in particular. Or the nice. Oh, you're welcome, Gail. Yeah, I sent out a bunch of happy mail. All right, let's see. Now I need a little darker blue. I think I'll add just a touch of black to it. Let's just darken that up a little. If you're a globe maker, if you're a, if you are a world globe maker, do not email me. <laughs> Don't email me, people. <laughs> it's gonna be lighter over there so all right let's see here oops too too dark just need a little smudge over there I just want you to be able to know that this is the earth, you know, that's the idea. 
Otherwise, I could just cut out a picture, which I've got tons of pictures of the Earth, you know, and different books on space. <laughs> Ground control to Major Tom. Good one. Good one, Dev. Don't make me sing. <laughs> okay. So now let's see about doing, and I'll do, I can do the glow around it with pencil. So that's not a problem. So let's go ahead and do a little bit of white here. All right. So now we're going to do a little bit of cloud action. Got to do this, do this kind of, let me, all right, let me move my camera. Shh, 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 shh. That's what I do when I'm in the, like, and trying to do a thinking mode, you know, like, you know, like really concentrate. I'm not telling y'all to hush. I'm telling myself like. Okay. Just get a nice little base on here. I don't know. That looks like they have a hurricane brew brewing out there in this uh, picture. Do you want a little bit of uh, storm action going on? I'm going to put more with uh, pencil and a little bit more of the baby wipe. Just got to do a little at a time. Just take your time. Just take All right, there's a nice start. I'm going to get in there with a the baby wipe in a minute. Okay, now what I'm going to do is take, uh, maybe I'll get a clean baby wipe. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to take my baby wipe. Y'all know how I take the paint and mash it into the baby wipe, right? Mash, mash, mash it in. Okay. <clears throat> Oops, a little much, too much mashing. <laughs> okay. And I'll go back with a little bit pencil work. All right, so let's see, let's try this. Those that are just coming in, y'all know I have 17 sitting over here. I got 17 more of these for y'all to watch me do. I'm just kidding. I'm not going to do them all today. I mean, not here on camera. <laughs> I'm not going to make y'all watch them. Okay, now let's see. Let me get some pencils over here now. All right, let's see. Ultramarine is too blue. Let's see. I might have to go with indigo. We'll see. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Do my sharpen. Let me sharpen. And don't forget, guys, if you don't get notifications or you're not haven't rung the bell or given me a thumbs up. 
Thanks, Linda. Uh, make sure, and this is true of other streamers too, sometimes you have to click the bell and unclick the bell and click it a couple, two, three times until you see where it says get all notifications, not just um, some, I forget what it says, occasional. And also, guys, make sure that um, you click the live chat at the top of the video above the chat, live chat. Okay, so let's see what we can do here with some pencils. Try to stay in camera here. All right, so I'm going to start with the uh, indigo. And my indigos, I put uh, blue tape around so I know. Because um, I'm going to want... And, and also, the other thing, guys, I'm probably not going to get this um, where the sun is. I, I mean, I'm kind of imagining... Like maybe the sun's coming from over here behind the earth. But then, you know, I, don't don't email me and say, you got that all wrong. <laughs> uh, you know what I mean? Don't email me and tell me that. Okay. I forgot about the live chat. Yeah. Okay. Dee, didn't you know the earth is flat? <laughs> Depends on what dimension you're looking at it from. Depending on what dimension you're in. Okay, let's see. Um, let's go ahead. Let's see here. Because I'm gonna have a gonna have a star shine on this side. I want a little bit of a glow, kind of ending sort of like that. Something like that, guys. Because I'm going to have a, let's see, maybe I'll start with a little bit of paint here. Let's go with the Posca pen. That'll be easier. Where's my Posca? I know I got a white Posca. Here it is, somewhere. Oh, thanks, Terry. Thanks, guys. And then when that dries, I'll put a glow around the star here. I'll wait till I have to wait till it dries though, because I'll just be smearing it. All right, now let's go back. Let's go up here a little bit on the moon. This is what I was going to tell y'all. It's going to be nice and glowy. Let me go back to my moon. Where's my moon? Um, oh, thanks, guys. Thumbs up. Thank you.
You make the prettiest stuff. <laughs> thank you, Kenny. Oh, thank you. So that's going to look, it, it, it actually needs to be on this side. But the light is on this side. Should have put the moon over there. Okay, I'll just, uh, I'm going to just make it not right. <laughs> the light. I'll have to readjust the, I have to, re, I have to move the light. I have to readjust the light here. All right, so let's go ahead and make this side. Sorry, guys, I'm not really talking much. I'm kind of like in the zone trying to get these done. <laughs> Light disaster averted. Too much over here it needs to be a little more blue, I think. All righty. All right, so now what I'm going to do, let's see if I can do this. Something like that. <clears throat> oh, thank you. Thanks, guys. All right. Now, what else do I want? I want a little bit of nebulization, but not too much. I want it far away. Let's go this way. I want it far away. This is my tribute to the lunar blood moon wolf howling. What do they call it? That all kinds of names for it. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry your kitty's not feeling well, Gracelyn. That's no fun when your pets are sick. Okay. Something like that. A little bit more white here. Nope, need the darker one. Okay, let me look at my moon picture again.
Sorry, guys, I'm not really chatting much and I'm concentrating. Wolf blood full moon. Hey, yeah, something like that. Oh, no, Suze, that is a disaster. You know how to fix that in an emergency? You know how to get coffee in an emergency if your coffee pot died? You want me to tell you or do you know? <laughs> Uh, do you want me to tell you, or do you know how to what to do? How to make how to make drip coffee? You know how to make co drip coffee if your coffee pot dies? I can tell you. Let's go, army wife here. I can tell you. <laughs> you take um, you boil some water, boil water on the on the stove. Boil water. Go ahead and and make your pot of coffee. I mean, you know, if you have a drip coffee maker. In the in, put your little filter in, put your coffee in, put your coffee pot underneath, boil the water, pour the boiling water. You know, it takes a minute. You gotta take give it a minute and just pour boiling water over the top of the water in the coffee pot. Let it drip down into the coffee pot, and you'll have a full pot of coffee. If you need to heat, I don't like to microwave coffee, but you can. So yeah. Yeah, there you go, Janet. Just pour the boiling water over the grounds. <laughs> okay, so there we go. I think that might be enough. Maybe this one needs just a little more orange, maybe. Right here. So there, yeah, this will be my tribute to the uh, the moon, old eclipse. All right, I need to fix something down here. Let me go back to my earth picture. Let's see. Need a little bit more cloud action going on down here, I think. It has a weird ending. It ends weird right there on the edge, which, you know, hey, we're on the edge of the world. So there we go. That's a little better. Just have some of the clouds coming up like that. Get that little storm action going in there. <laughs> Maybe just a touch of the white right in the center. Okay, I think I think that ought to do it, guys. And again, I'll paint the backs. And I have 16 more to go. <laughs> oh, I don't even have, I don't even own instant coffee. Well, I should take that back. I think there's some instant coffee and some MREs. Uh, in the MREs, I probably have some instant coffee. <laughs> but uh, yeah, a little bit more shadow on the star right there. Okay, I, I better quit. I better quit. Okay, so there's my two um, art cards that I'm making. I'm, I have a whole bunch I want to make. You know, I made a... <laughs> You don't want to watch me make them? <laughs> Just kidding. I'm not going to make you watch me make all these. <laughs> okay, guys. So, all right. So, there's, a, there's the two. <laughs> Sorry. I had to tease y'all a little. All right. Make sure I got everything here. Oh, 
I hear a little Malibu out there. You want me to let her in for a minute before I start another project? Ah, <sighs> okay. Um, before I get love the ink house stream, the Rubens paint effects. Oh, thank you, Nana. Yeah, I'm gonna work more. I, you know, I got lots of projects on the go. I was glad to get a little something done in um glad to get a little something done on all the pages in the ink house. I love that book. If y'all missed it, I did a little coloring on every single page in the ink house. Color book last week. All righty. So this is my tribute to the uh, tribute to the uh, what do you call it the uh, eclipse. That's smoother. A little smoother right there. Brighten up a couple little areas. I keep saying I'm done, but you know how it goes. All right. I'll, tw I'll put them on. I'll tweet them out later. Oh, thanks, guys. So there we go. I need one little. Okay. All right. So I'm going to take these away. <laughs> What's the color book you just mentioned, Grayson? The Ink House. This one. There's a full flip. I colored something on every page. It's by Rory Dobner. This book was en enabled for me to buy by Deb, the modernist colorist. He showed it on his channel. <laughs> I had to buy it. Okay, so I'm going to move all this paint out of the way for a minute. And let's see, I gotta make some room here. Has anybody seen Robin Loves Reading? I keep looking over here to the right and I see something for her. And uh, <laughs> and I keep wanting to say, I gotta give that to her and she's not here. So, okay, let's move all of the paint out of the way for a minute. All right. Put that blue back up, move the phone. With all the brushes and the pencils and the, I gotta make room if I'm gonna do spread out a um, a scroll. I'm almost out of my um, shipping paper. My shipping paper, it's just a roll of brown shipping paper. That's what I use to. Um, I call my art scroll. See, where do I put these for a minute? <laughs> oh, Robin stopped by my stream last night. She's around. Well, I meant to, I meant here, faithful. I meant if she was here. Okay. <clears throat> so it's just a roll of shipping paper. Move my iPad and my phone. Um, take a sip of coffee. All righty. So I'm, all, I'm down to the end of the roll. So it's a little um, tight because it's, you know, the end of the roll. So I got my tape here. I'm going to tape it down. And I just thought we would draw. Now let me see. Am I backed out all the way? Let's see. There we go. And uh, let's see. I need to move this over this way. Let's adjust the, I'll adjust the camera once I pull the, put it, the thing out here. Right, so I have to make room is what I'm doing here. Have to make room to tape this out. There's the edge of the table there. Let's go that way. Let's go this way. <laughs> Sorry, guys, when I have the whole table to deal with, I'm gonna try to get it straight. 
Okay, <clears throat> not that it matters. So I thought I would do a couple different things. I thought about doing... I thought about doing some on the end of this paper. I've got to get me another roll of this paper. It's just shipping paper, guys. Uh, if you want to have an art scroll, you can get the white paper. You can have... Um, you can do it on a craft paper. You know, this is a, it's just, it, it's inexpensive to do art on a roll of brown paper. Now I'm going to probably have to readjust the lighting because, you know, it is uh, now I've changed to brown. So I'm just going to tape this down so that it's not shifting around. And I just thought we'd do a little drawing. I mean, you know, draw some stuff. I don't know. I mean... Maybe, uh, let me look at my phone here in a minute, or my iPad. All right, let's see about the lighting first. Because we have changed colors. <laughs> All right, let's see about what's going on in chat. Always, oh, thank you, Sammy. Good morning, Dee. Hi, Diana. Thank you. I had some... Oh yeah, you had yeah, you got your beetles. Yeah. Okay, Diana. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, so again, this is just shipping a roll of shipping paper. You can get it for three or four dollars for like I don't know how many feet. 50 feet, a hundred feet. I don't know. You get a lot for three three bucks, right? So um Where's Malibu? I didn't let her in because she she stopped scratching on the door. So I stopped thinking about letting her in. Okay, so let's see. Let's get some. Do I want to just start with some Conti crayon? Y'all know I don't like chalk, but Conti crayon's kind of a little bit. It's not as um, it's not as dry. And I'll use chalk if I have to to sketch and stuff. I don't like the feel of chalk, but you know, hey. This doesn't, it doesn't hurt, it doesn't kill me to touch it. But I should, I don't know if this, I might need to tape this down just a little more. It wants to, it's wanting to pop up. <clears throat> so I think what I'm going to do is I might do a couple drawings. One, I think I'll try one here on the brown paper. And then we'll do another one on the white paper. Um, the reason I liked and the reason I started using, well, I've done it before. I like life drawing and stuff. You, you can use rolls of paper. But I started doing it on stream here because it shows up on camera. When I use my blue lead pencil on white paper to sketch something out, you don't see it. You don't see the sketch, right? Uh, packing paper from delivery. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Um, it's usually crumpled, though, Suze. That's the only thing about that. That if you get the pa packing paper that's, you know, ship something shipped in. I like to use that for more mixed media rather than drawing. Um, okay, so I have some alpacas here. I'm just looking at my <laughs> what I have in my phone. I got some alpacas. I got some lionfish. Um, what do I want to do? I don't want to do lemurs because I love my lemurs. And I, draw, I just did that poster with the lemurs. Um, but you know what? I don't know. Maybe, um, what do I want to draw? If I do a poster with ink on white paper, then that would probably be good to have a, have like, um, lionfish on the white paper. Maybe we'll do some alpacas here. Let me see here. I got a whole bunch of pictures, tons of them. I got the white ones, the brown ones. You know, all shapes and sizes of alpacas. Maybe we'll do one of each. Maybe we'll do, oh, sorry, guys. I, would, my, oh, I missed up my can. Let's see. Maybe I'll do one of each. Maybe I'll do one of the cream color. Or do, I got two or three different ones. Let's do a couple alpacas. <laughs> and then we'll draw on the white paper, which it might be hard for you to see. Can, all, can you guys hear me okay? Is my mic okay and everything? I never, I always forget to ask. As long as they're not spitting. Now, I won't make any spitting alpacas, right? Okay. This one has kind of a breezy hair style. Let's see if I put one here. Let's let's see which way the other one's looking. Let's see. Well, they're both kind of looking at you. So I'll do one. This one looks like it needs a haircut. The other one that's kind of a russet color. <laughs> 
Okay, so let's see here. All right, so I'm going to do... I'm going to do it over on this kind of over here because I'm going to do the other one over here. But I should move the camera a little over this way. Let's see, guys. I'm crooked. And that's all. There we go. Because I'm going to put one here and one here. So let's just... And I'm just going to use acrylic paint, guys. I won't finger paint today. You know, last time we did finger painting. <clears throat> We won't do finger painting today. Can y'all see? See, that looks too flashed out. Hang on. Let's go back over to the lighting. Looks too bright, too bright. And that looks too dark. Where's the color? <laughs> looks like a weird color. How's that look? If that looks, it looks really weird lighting. I mean, weird color, but I think you can kind of see. Y'all tell me. How's that look? Hi, Bonnie. All right, let's see. Let's see what we can do here because I'm gonna we're gonna get out the acrylic paints. I'm just gonna sketch them out first. They're very kind of thin faces, long, thin faces. And then they've got lots of fur. Lots of fur, which we're going to put in with, uh, we're going to put in with paint, neck, layers of fur. <laughs> All right, let's see here. <clears throat> And I've got about four or five different ones here, so we'll see which. I'm just going to kind of pick colors from one, maybe, you know, no, I don't know. Let's just get them blocked in here. Okay. There's going to be one. <laughs> All right, we'll start with that. All right, let's go to the other one that I saw. Where's that other one? Ah, here we go. This one, he'll have him kind of. He's got the reddish fur, and it's close. It's close. Um, it's like he's just had a shave. And the other thing about these guys is if you draw something like this, you know, y'all seen, I've cut them out. You can cut them out and use them, use them on uh, other projects. Okay, let's see if we can go with this. We're gonna roll with these. We're gonna roll with that. <laughs> so flashed out though, guys. What do you how's it look? Does it look horrible? The lighting? It looks dark right here. Let's see if I move that light and put the Yeah, that's better. Oh, thanks, Pacola. Yeah, y'all, thanks all for all the thumbs up. Okay, that's gonna be enough. I just want to sketch it out enough to paint on it. Right, everything else is gonna be done with paint. All right, let's get a baby wipe or two. All righty. Let's see if I can make some room here. All right, let's get some paints. I've got black here from that cards. Mm -hmm. Make sure everything's dry. All right, so here's all that black. All right, so now I'm going to get some terracotta. A couple things of terracotta. This is dry, so I'm just go right over it. Lighting looks good. Okay, thanks, guys. And a little bit of like a yellow ochre and tan. 
Oh, this is the one that's got dried up paint in the... And these are just craft paint, guys. It's just fun to do some craft painting. Um, that's the same. I need a little bit of a tan color. Let's see. Let's go with this one. No, let's go with this one. <clears throat> Thanks, guys. So anyway, I just thought that Monday would be kind of fun to just do some other than the tribute to the tribute to the moon, <laughs> to the eclipse, that we could do um, some mixed media. And then also, again, I want to do, I'll do a separate video of the going through the, um, here, let me show you again. Through all my dilutions, well, some of them have a lot in, some of them don't. But anyway, go through my dilutions journals and show how to do a collage from, these started as a blank page. So show you how to do collage from a, from a, you know, just from a blank page. All right, so there, and I got my black here. What else do I need? Probably some, a little bit of purple. Let's get a little bit of purple in here. Oh, uh, thanks, Graceland. Thanks, guys. All right, so let's go ahead and start here. Oh, I'm gonna get me some. oh I dumped over my little bucket of stars. <laughs> I thought I had everything moved out of the way. Not quite. All right. No baby wipes. I'm telling you guys, you can go through a I can go through a a pack of baby wipes a week in here. All right, so let's see. Let's um Let's get something other than my jacked up brush. <laughs> okay, I need a nice angle brush. Sure. Let me this nice in here. Right. Angle brushes are my favorite, and they're always the ones I run out of the most. Always run out of my angle brushes. Um, I'm going to have to go with this flat for now anyway. We'll see how it goes. All right. So let's see here. Let's start with this guy here. And, and again, I'm just going to base coat them at first. And then we will um, we'll put detail in with pencil. And I just want to, you know, play a little, show y'all that you can just play on craft paper. Right? Uh, shipping paper, rather. It's just shipping paper. Remember, we did the finger painting a couple weeks ago for the Wizard of Oz characters. That I don't know how we ended up with those. I mean, why we chose those. Nice big ears. And I am using a reference, but I'm not necessarily trying to do a portrait. I just want to do some alpacas, right? A little bit of purple here. Because I think they look cute. Eyelashes and all. <laughs> So y'all working on anything, doing anything, or just watching? Trying to read chat. You're eating, Jean. What are you eating? Bre are you having breakfast? What are you eating today, Jean? Just out of curiosity. You don't have to tell us.
watching paint dry, waiting for my upload to process rather just watching the paint. Okay. <laughs> um, Faithful, um, do you, when you do your videos, do you, are you editing them a lot or something? Is that why you are recording them and having to upload them? I don't edit anything per se. <laughs> I don't edit anything. So when I record, when I record my videos, I just record them live but on private and there's, I don't edit anything. So the, I don't have to do any, I don't have to upload anything. Okay. Yeah. But if you just, if you don't want to do a bunch of uh, editing or if you don't do a bunch of editing, just record your video on live, but private until you want it to go up. And then just hit public. There's nothing to upload. It's already there. It's already there. You, you've recorded it. It's on YouTube. All you have to do is go in, you know, tag it, name it, you know, tag it and bag it or whatever, you know, and uh, just hit public. Working, drawing playgrounds and watching. Drawing playgrounds, Madonna. I have to in, and figure that out. Oh, Holly, you changed your name back. <laughs> now you won't get muted. <laughs> scavenger hunt. Holly's doing scavenger hunt. Still takes a while to process. Well, it, yeah, Gene, if you're doing a, you know, if you're doing a three or four hour video like this, it might take an hour to process. If you're just wanting to do like my 45 minute videos, well, I would like to keep them under 45 minutes and I record my coloring catch-ups. If I keep them 45 minutes to an hour, there's no process time. They're immediate. It's because they're not long. There's no chat to process. They're right there immediately, Jean. Yeah, so uh -oh, let's see. Let me get my little guy back here. All right, so let's see. Let's go ahead and get a base coat in here. Yeah, you forgot about the chat. Yeah, because if you're not chatting, there's less to um, process. There's really nothing to process, actually. <laughs> it, just got, it just goes right up, you know, it just goes right on. Yeah, so it's weird when there's when it's a holiday and there's no mail. I'll do the I'll get the eyes in here in a minute so it doesn't freak people out. They don't people don't like not having eyes. Just getting it all based in. I just roll with it. <laughs> I just roll with it. A little purple and brown down here. So has anybody else bought, since all the years that we've been doing this on the scrolls, has anybody else um, bought a roll of craft paper <clears throat> to play on like this? Bueller, Bueller, Bueller. <laughs> He'll do freak out over no eyes. Yeah, yeah. Well, he's got some pupils in there, so... <laughs> Uh, 
and any of the chalk that's left, I'll just erase it, you know. <laughs> Okay, let's get a little more lighter color here. Don't judge me. Oh, what did you do? I'm sitting on the corner. <laughs> Nobody's judging you around here. <laughs> okay, it needs more yellow than it does white. So let's do it here for you. <laughs> Okay, Jan says she bought a scroll, and it's so pristine in the original package. Oh, <laughs> uh, you know, I ought to, what I ought to do, Janet, is what I ought to do. Now, this is thick. Look how much paint's on there. Can you see how thick that paint is on there? It's thick. We're gonna we're gonna put it on thick. Uh, what I ought to do, Janet, is go on your show um, today and ask you to pull out that scroll. And and see how that works is I get I get Eileen in there with me. If Eileen's in there with me in on it, then <laughs> then you'll do it because Eileen said. <laughs> I'm trying to keep him kind of. Um, like he's his his fur is very thick and fluffy, and again, guys, I'm not trying to you know copy a port do a portrait here. I'm just got, getting essence of essence of alpaca. <clears throat> oh, Ashley, thank you, thank you for the super super chat. Hi, back at you. Make sure you email me if you want some happy mail. Email me. Somebody can put in my email there, and I'll uh, send out you a little. Happy mail. I try to do that to everybody that super chats or um, uh, PayPal, PayPal um, tip jar. Thank you, Ashley. Very sweet. All right, let's see here. Let's need a little purple. <clears throat> Let's get his little nose in here. Let's get this all blocked in. I'm using more purple than blue, but we can always go. Maybe it was that blue. I know some blue left over yeah. from the moon here. Let's use the rest. Let's use some of that. His nose. How's the color? Is it? Well, maybe. Okay, I guess it's okay. I throw in those colors and the camera goes, what, 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 what? <laughs> uh, there's going to be a lot of pencil work in here, too. Okay, let's do a little bit on the eyes here. I don't know how fun this is for you guys, but <laughs> it's fun for me. It's fun for me to do this. Yeah, thank you so much, anybody that's supporting the channel. I appreciate it, guys. Very much. All this is going to be done with pencil. I 
I just thought it'd be fun to have a mixed media day. Um, all right, let's see. Let's get uh, let's get this lighter here. I need a background. A lighter. Oops. And some white. Let's bring some of that over here. Oh, I gotta think of something to talk about, guys. We're not just sitting here. Get, some, get think of some stories to tell you. That's funny. Hubster goes, "Have you told them about this or that? Have you told them this story?" I went, "Honey, no, no, I haven't told them about that." <laughs> uh, Could tell y'all about the time I got stung by a scorpion. What else? Just getting this like where I want it to before I start adding more stuff. You like him? Okay. Well, it's a little. The color's a little mm, mm, eh, meh, but it's not too bad. <laughs> I'm gonna get his nose and eyes blocked in, then he'll really start looking like something, you know. More white. You create, oh, I'm happy to be here. Thank you, Sammy. Yeah, it's just, you know, it's fun sometimes just to hang out. We don't have to necessarily be, you know, be Picasso every week or every day, every stream. You know, I never feel like that. And if I wanted to experiment with something, I don't mind doing it in front of you. If it doesn't turn out, I don't care. <laughs> I mean, I care. You know, I, I want it to turn out. But do I, you know, do I, I don't know. If it doesn't, it doesn't. You know, we just, we roll with it. And, you know, if you, if you're, if you do a lot of one medium or another and something doesn't turn out or you'll go, oh, Dee Dee, the reason that didn't turn out is X, Y, Z. Okay, well, now, now, next time you know not to do that. Right? <laughs> tell the spider story um i'm not sure what the spider story I, I you mean the you mean the uh uh scorpion the scorpion story i'm not sure i have a spot which spider story oh the one where okay maybe this is the one that you're talking about Suze. when um when Hubster went out of town, TDY, you know, he's retired military. He'd be gone, you know, sometimes weeks at a time. And uh, me and the girls were home. This one's not that dramatic. I'll tell you, if you want to hear a dramatic spider story, go watch Whoa, Suzanne. Whoa, Suzanne spider story cannot be beat. Just saying. It cannot be beat. But in the meantime... <laughs> So uh, it, I think I think the scorpion story is better than this one, but I'll tell this one too. So he went TDY, and uh, this was where was this one? Was this in? This must have been. Yeah, it was before. Well, yeah, it was. It was years ago. <laughs> I know, right? Nobody could beat that Woe Suzanne story. If y'all do not follow Woe Suzanne on Facebook. Or it might probably on YouTube too, right? Um, well, wait a minute. Let me look. I'll I'll talk while I'm I'm looking it up. And uh, <laughs> so anyway, yes, hers is the best spider story ever. Mine isn't that big, bad, big of a story. 
but uh, let me turn my volume down here. So, so um, anyway, he was TD. I went into the bedroom and I saw a spider. I swear it was this big. Well, it was this big, <laughs> this big run under my bed, run under my bed. And the girls didn't see it, but I don't think, I don't think they saw it. I think it was just me. Hang on, guys. I'm looking up. Whoa, Suzanne. Well, I can't show you the whole thing, but I can give you a, you know, a link or uh, show you a minute of it. You have to go watch it. Whoa, Suzanne Spider. And um, <laughs> I found it. I found it. It's called, if you just look up Whoa, Suzanne, W-H-O-A, Suzanne, it's called It Was On My Face. That's the name of her video. It was on my face. <laughs> so anyway, I saw the spider run under the bed. And I think he was going to be gone another week. <laughs> so, you know, I did what any good army wife would do. I closed the bedroom door, put a towel along the bottom, and did not go back in my bedroom for a week. <laughs> when Hobster came home, he said, I told him, I said, there's a spider in the bedroom. Can't go in there. I can't go in there. You have to go in there. Go kill that spider. So he, he said, well, okay. So he moved the bed. And he said, come here. He said, come here a minute. Wait, let me. Just... He said, is that what you're talking about? <laughs> no, I think I sprayed. I sprayed it. That's what I did, guys. I sprayed it with bug spray. I got, I saw in the bedroom, I got, this is 20, 25 years ago, guys. I'm trying to remember. Uh, I got the bug spray. I sprayed it and it ran under the bed. And when he moved the bed, it was, it was like, it was probably more like that. <laughs> so I sprayed it It curled up and died. Right. But there was no way, no way was I sleeping in that room. No freaking way was I sleeping in that room <laughs> but anyway all right let me let me just show you okay so this is Suzanne if you don't know who she is that's whoa Suzanne now she's telling the story it's 10 minutes long I'm not going to show you the whole thing but I want you to see just a minute hang on or like 30 seconds of it hang on let me get to a spot here let's see if I can show this I'm going to jump off because in order to stop the zero target, okay so she was on a lawnmower so wait a minute Okay, it could have used like you could, when after this, after this spider, she's talking spider, about the size of the spider. I'm not lying, a turby legs and enough hair to do a French braid. I'm not kidding. Okay, a fishtail. And I mean, like, you could put that thing's hair up. Okay, it, it could have used like you could, when after this, after this spider takes a shower, it needs a turby twist. <laughs> <laughs> you got to go watch it, guys. I'm serious. If you want to go watch it now while I'm painting, I don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> guys let me get a sip of coffee mm. <laughs> i'm serious guys it is so so stinking funny i mean it's one of the funniest things i, I could la i could watch that a hundred times i'm not joking it is so stinking funny <laughs> Okay, so let me, um, yeah, the other time, and I know I told y'all this a couple of times, I don't know what made me think about the spider and the scorpion stories. So um, I'm allergic to bees. And so when you're allergic to something like bees, you don't know what other insects you could possibly be allergic to. So uh, when I got, to, okay, I'm in uh, some of the family's group chat. Let me, let me, let me turn that down. Let me mute that. That should do. Um, <clears throat> uh, you don't you don't know what else you might be allergic to if you're allergic to bees, right? So we had just moved into uh, a new house with the kids and everybody, and I I well, this may be there may be two I may I might be conflating two different uh, scorpion stories in the same story. I don't I don't remember. <laughs> but anyway. Um, so one night, um, sleeping in bed, 
I felt something like if you take a hot, imagine this is what it feels like. You're going to name your, oh, am I going to name my alpacas? I'll let y'all, I'll let y'all name them. <laughs> I'll let y'all name the alpacas. Um, so if you have never been stung by a scorpion, and this is not the, this is not the deadly kinds out in the, in the desert. This is in Texas, right? This is a Texas scorpion. They're, they're, you know, I'm sure there's some deadly ones out there too. These are just the ones, you know, your, your average, you know, scorpions about that big. They're not, they're not the, the deadly poisonous kind. <laughs> I'm taking my time here, guys. I'm not really, I'm not in any rush, as you can see. Um, so they, uh, it's just one about this big. So anyway, if you want to know what it feels like to get stung by a scorpion, take a hot match, take a match, light the match, blow out the match and immediately touch it to your skin. That's what a, scor a scorpion sting feels like. Like someone took a hot burning match to you. So I jump up in the middle of the night because I had, I had um, got stung on the side of the neck, on the neck, right? And what had happened is a scorpion dropped off the ceiling. It had gotten the air conditioning duct, I guess. Dropped off the ceiling and stung me on the neck. So I immediately jump up and I go, something bit me. And Hubster goes, what, what? Turns on the light. I jump up and sit, sit on the scorpion. And it stings me again. Now, I don't know how it can sting you twice. Because I would have thought that that stinger could only do you, you know, but anyway, so I sat on it. Well, the second one didn't hurt as much as the first one in my neck, right? So because I was allergic to bees, I went, well, Am I, you know, what's a scorpion sting like? If I'm allergic to bees, am I going to die because <laughs> of the scorpion sting? And so I call the, I call the hospital. And I said, look, I'm allergic to, I'm allergic to bees. Um, I don't know if this has anything to do with it, but you know, I, I got, you know, I, I mean, not anything to do with it, but if you're allergic to bees, are you allergic to scorpions? She goes, well, if you're not sure, you better just go ahead and come on into the emergency room. So we get all dressed and go. It's about probably about 30 minutes away. Go to the emergency room. Wait in the emergency room now, mind you. And I think my tongue's going numb at the time. I think I felt my tongue starting to go numb. And I thought, is this, is this a uh, you know, is this a sign of you know apticoleptic shock? What is it called? <laughs> you know what I mean? And um, so I go in and finally got to see the doctor. Throws a throws an ice pack, throws an ice pack on my neck. Goes, uh, okay, there you go. You can go. Uh, you can go sign out over at the desk now. So go over to the desk. I say, yeah, that'll be fifty dollars. I said, but is that it? Yeah, yeah, you're okay. You just got stung by a scorpion. Yeah, anaphylactic shock. Yeah, thank you, Holly. And so I go. I said, so that's it. He goes, yeah, that's it's. You're okay. I said, well, you know, I thought to myself, why didn't you just tell me that? Why didn't you just tell me? It's just a scorpion sting. You're going to live. Oh, no. Throw throw ice pack on you and charge you 50 bucks. And this was 30 years ago, maybe more, guys. So, you know, I'm sure those ice packs are a lot more expensive now. So <laughs> I just broke my brush. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I was cleaning my brush and went, snap. See, these are cheap brushes, guys. <laughs> Let me get another cheap brush. So anyway, that was that was it. Yeah. Let me find another brush here. <laughs> oh, let's see. One of these three here. <laughs> what did Monk? What did uh, Janet say? I'll show this. Okay. Um, I missed something. Great idea, monkey. I missed something, I, uh, Elaine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 50 bucks will get you a bag of frozen peas. <laughs> exactly, Julie. Okay, so let us uh, let me dry this. and uh, Or should I go ahead and put some paint? I think I'll go ahead and put some paint on this one. And then we'll go, uh, and then I'll go in here and do some detailing. Okay, which one did I have? This one. Okay, so this one's white and cream. It's, uh, yeah. <laughs> and I can't move my paper because it's taped down. So I got to just kind of move my camera. 
So there's a there's our base code. You're gonna show stamps and sell some. Are you gonna sell some stamps today? Oh my gosh! All right. So if y'all are interested in stamps, Janet's gonna show stamps on her stream today and sell some. Good for you for getting rid of some. Jean said, "Dee, you wouldn't have made it half hour to ER without swelling." Well, see, it did. My tongue did kind of swell, Jean. But you know, I didn't have any idea how long it would take to die from a scorpion sting. You know? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so let's go over here. And now I'm going to get some cream and white. And uh, and there's no, I'm not adding any water to any of this, guys. It's right out of the jar. And it's very um, thick. Okay, so let's go ahead and start. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Anyway, so there's my two bins bit by something. I don't remember if there's anything else. Probably, but I'm not thinking of them right now. <laughs> it was scary. You know, it was scary. I don't know. I didn't know. Because I'm was. i allergic to bees. I mean, you know. This one's got lots of uh, flowy, windblown look. <laughs> And it's got a lot of back color here. I should put some of that brown in there first and then put the white on top of it here. Let's get that base. Let's get that in there. And then he's, this was my black. Let's go ahead and get some. And I'm not even cleaning my brush or anything, guys. I just go in, just dip right in to the next color. And if it gets too crusted up or like now, if I want to go from this black, to wipe, then I'll just wipe my um, brush off on a baby wipe, you know, right here. So that's a little flashed out. I don't know what the, uh, yeah. If my tongue started swelling, I would have freaked <laughs> I am. Well, I kind of did a little, you know, but then I'm thinking to myself, you know, being a military, you would know, Anne, you would know, having a military dad. You would know, um, yeah, you don't want to, you can't, you can't be too afraid because that aggravates the situation, regardless of the situation. You start getting afraid and the situation just gets way blown out of proportion, right? <laughs> so I don't want to get this too much detail. You're also just going to kind of block it in. I'll get more of the, the fur and the detail here, you know, with, you know, littler pit, uh, paint brushes or a nice angle brush here. I'm just kind of blocking them in. And it looks really terrible. The lighting. Oh my gosh, guys. I don't know what to do about that. It's like, oh, what happened to my color? What happened? Okay, guys, I'm going to do something here. I'm going to default the color back and I'm going to have to change it again. So just give me a minute. I'm going to default it. Okay. Now I got to go back and, and, and just do a little adjusting here. Color, 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 color. I don't know. Is that any better? I don't know if it's any better or not. I don't know. I might have made it worse. I might have made it worse. Okay. We're going to roll with it, though. <laughs> what happened to the scorpion? Oh, I'm sure we killed it. I'm sure we smashed it. You know, I'm sure we smashed it. Okay, so let's just get his face blocked in here. Whoops. So what's the worst thing any of y'all have got bit by? I mean, like, you know, don't don't tell me it was a pit bull or something, but I mean, <laughs> what's the worst thing? <laughs> oh my gosh, God, I'm so sorry about this light. It's just, it just really looks odd, but anyway. Um, 
what's the worst thing y'all have ever got bit or stung by? I need more white paint. Overdosed on two minch. <laughs> you have an imagination there, Miss Nancy. You got bit by a spider monkey, Miss Jamie? A hornet, Susan said a hornet. Yeah, and you don't, and the other thing around here, you don't want to get stung by. Ask Suze or anybody that lives in the South. Uh, yeah, fire ants. Oh my gosh. Don't step in a fire ant nest. Don't do it, people. Don't do it. <laughs> They're everywhere down here. Okay, let's see here. I just got to base all this in, guys. So let me just go ahead and do that real quick. See, this one needs a haircut. This one just had a haircut. <laughs> uh, I hope y'all are having fun today. I mean, I am. I got some videos planned for record. You know, some shorter ones planned. But uh, yeah. <laughs> a Saint Bernard. Oh, no. You got bit by a St. Bernard as a teenager, Jean? He broke a chain and came after you and bit you on the arm? Oh, my gosh. He was bigger than me. Oh, bless your little white-headed self, Jean. Have y'all never seen Jean as a child? Oh, my gosh. You would want to adopt her. <laughs> I mean, I still want to adopt her now, but, you know, you want to adopt little Miss Sassy Pants when she was little. <laughs> Oh, well, keep at it. Keep at it, Ashley. Ashley says she's on day two of quitting smoking. There's other girls here that are trying to quit smoking, too. Y'all ought to talk to each other. Um, yeah. Give it three days to get the, the nicotine out of your bloodstream, and the rest is psychological. Drink lots of water, Ashley. Good, good for you. Keep at it. One more day, Ashley. One more day. You can do it. Let me see if I can find a picture of Jean. When she was little. I know she has some on Twitter somewhere. Let me see if I can find one. Go, Ashley. Go, Ashley. Yay, Susie. Yeah, y'all give, give Ashley some encouragement and any tips. Um, let me see. Music, Jean. Jean, I'm sure you have some pictures, right? Let me go on your media. Oh, yeah, we're calling Jean out. I'm going to scroll through her media. Oh, here she is. <laughs> now, this is not a very close-up one, but here's little Jean. She she and her sisters. All right, first let me show you this. Let me turn down the lighting here. Here's Jean and her sisters. All They always had matching outfits. Here's little Miss Sassy Pants. Look at little Jean. <laughs> That's not the best one. There's better ones of Jean. She is so cute. I know. Little, little Jean. And, and I know she, she's told her stories before. Jean is, was born albino. So she has very, she you know can't have, she has 10% vision. She has white hair and, you know, pale. Little Miss Sassy Pants was the cutest thing ever when she was a baby. I'm still scrolling here, uh, Jean. See if I can find a, a close-up one. So cute. And they, they always, oh, and one of the outfits, I'm just calling out Jean. Sorry, Jean, I can't help it. Uh, she showed one out uh, with her sisters and the, they had matching crocheted shorts. And I said, I haven't worn crocheted shorts since I was in, when we went to Germany and they all wore, well, they wore crocheted knitted, knitted and crocheted shorts. I mean, can you think of anything else less comfortable than knit shorts? <laughs> uh, I'm looking at, Jean's got some awesome paintings in here. Uh, hang on, Jean. I, wanna, uh, 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 I know there's, there's, I would love to find that picture of you and your sisters in your shorts. I'm scrolling. If you're watching the recording, just fast forward. Just fast forward. <laughs> you don't want us to see us talking about our jeans, little little outfits. Oh, there's the cat pictures. There's the home on vacation pictures. There's Jean's new luggage, her swatches. 
<laughs> her mate, her mom made them all. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Grandma made all our clothes too. I think some of them might have matched when we were little, but um, some of them might have matched. Oh, the kids are so cute, Jean. Sorry, reminiscing over Jean's family. <laughs> Oh, Robin, Robin. Wait, hang on, Robin. I got something for you. Um, I went, went to the store and Robin just started a, tra um, a um, traveler's notebook and she does book reviews, our Robin. So when I was at Hobby Lobby, oh, I'm not finding it, Jean. Now I'm all the way back to my Mona Lisa thing. Um, I don't know. Well, if I come across Jean again in her little matching um, crocheted outfits... It was just a thing of the day. I mean, it was not like, you know, it's just it's just funny. Oh, you you tweeted it. Oh, okay, Gene. Well, I'm still scrolling. Let me go back to <laughs> let me go back to Twitter and go to the main page. Okay, here we go. Oh, here we go. Let me turn it sideways. Oh my gosh. Look, look. These are crocheted outfits, guys. Crochet. There's look, there's our little Gene. Look at that. Crocheted pants can you think of anything more itchy to me i'd be i'd give myself a rash when <laughs> look at that <laughs> crochet and gee i'm you know i'm not making fun of it it's just you know i never would wear you know something <laughs> but it is cute so there's little jean there's our little jean she was little <laughs> They were they were fintex yarn that was for slippers. So there was it was soft, Jean. It wasn't itchy. Oh my gosh. All right. So uh, Robin. So I went to the store. <laughs> I have a I have a note on here for you. So I went to um uh, no, it wasn't Hobby Lobby. It was uh Tuesday morning. Tuesday morning, Robin. And I bought two of these, one for you and one for me. So I got you a bow bunny for only $2.99. Because you are a reader, a writer, and a, and a traveler notebook. But look, it's got text on it. Can you see? Text. Text on the feathers. Text on the birds. Text on the owl. So it's got text on. This one has music on it. So anyway, I got this for you, Robin. But can you resend me your address? I know I have your address somewhere. I just don't want to dig for it. Would you mind just sending me your address again so I can just pop it in an envelope and send it out? So yeah, I got I got one for you and one for me. So just just email me. I mean, I know like I said, I know I have your address somewhere, but it'd just be easier on me if you would just email it to me. You're welcome. I thought you would like it. Okay, let's get back to <laughs> sorry guys. Sorry, not sorry. I think I need some white over here. I need some gray. Okay. So let's do his little his little lips. Do alpacas have lips? Do alpacas have lips, guys? And again, guys, if you're watching this chat, I mean, if you're watching the show and you don't like the chat, just, uh, yeah, just uh, fast forward through the, the chat. Get our little alpaca face in here. Almost looks like he has a little mustache. <clears throat> okay, let's see here. Okay, a little bit of blue. Where's my blue? All right, there's our there's our start. <laughs> now that looks creepy. It's just a base. Prehensile lips, Connie. <laughs> 
I bet no two Tuesday mornings have the same things. Yeah, um, I actually went for looking for something specific, um, and they didn't have what I was looking for. So yeah, if you watch some, you know, sometimes, you know, I just have to accidentally really come across them. I don't go looking for Tuesday morning haul videos, but if I come across one, then I will. Um, I might sometimes watch it. Okay, that's a nice base. I got them based in. Looks kind of creepy, I know, but um, maybe I got bitten by a scorpion in his lip. <laughs> his face is, it's all this is fur, guys. His face is really very little. And there's going to be fur coming up around the eyes, but you got to get it coated in there to get it started. All right, so uh, well, let's just, I'm going to stop on that one for a minute and let's go back to the other one. Um. What time is it anyway? Two and a half hours? Two and a half hours have we played? We're just playing. Okay, let's see. All right. Um, let me hit this with a heat gun. Oh. <clears throat> Oh, Jean, that's good, Jean. Jean says this is her as an alpaca. You're so cute, Jean. <laughs> With your soft, flowy, wind-blown hair, Jean. <laughs> good one, Jean. Oh, but you, Holly found them, those stamps on Amazon. Yeah, let me tell you what they look. Here, let me show you the packaging here. Oh, uh, well, I can't get close enough to show you an ISBN or anything, but they're called birds of a feather. Yeah, she's um, uh, Holly said she found them on uh, Amazon for what did you say? Five ninety nine. Yeah. What's the regular price? Yeah, that's the regular price. Five ninety nine. So anyway, yeah. OK, so let's go ahead and do a little let's do a little on the faces here. Let's see. Let me get my pencils. Let's get some pencils. I have mine. Where's my blue? Where's my, here's my blue. Where's that? <clears throat> here's my white from, uh, i got to put that there. i got to remember to use it more. Maybe I'll try to use some more. This is the one from Vani, the Derwent White, Chinese White. Let's see. I need some purple, dark purple. No, I need a purple, purple. Let's see what's this one. Yep, that's that. Where's my real purple? Black grape. Let's see. Yeah, that'll probably work on this paper. Black, white, purple, blue, sienna. Maybe a little gold. I don't know. I'm not going to do this too. I'm not going to go in here too much detail. I just want to kind of, you know, play with this today. Hi, Charlotte. All right. Let's see if we can do something here, guys. Let's see if we can adjust. All right. That might work. <laughs> My lighting's way off because of And I didn't get to. I wanted to do a lionfish. I wanted to do a lionfish pencil and ink. What time is it? We got about an hour. Uh, I don't know that we're going to get to that today. All right, let's see here. Oh wait, let, let me put that white down and try to try to make myself use the Chinese white. Got to sharpen it though. Where's my sharp? <clears throat> okay. Get an eye in here so that nobody's nobody's freaked out, right? So I don't know how far we'll get on this, guys. Sharpening. 
these little alpacas are just <laughs> well it takes you know you gotta you gotta work let you know as the saying goes you gotta work past the uglies you know got a base this is all base coated in so you gotta you know have that base coat i keep breaking this black let me get a different black pencil that one keeps wanting to break i'm not gonna fight the pencil today All right, let's see here. Okay. <clears throat> Bye, Sammy. Thanks for stopping in on uh, alpaca and uh oh for those of y'all that just came in or came in late we did do these little cards here did some art cards based on the um lunar eclipse so we did these earlier i'll post pictures of them and i still have 17 more to do 18. <laughs> okay <clears throat> Okay. Give our alpaca. You wish you had eyelashes like the alpaca. I know, right? And we'll even exaggerate them even more. Why not? Okay, let's see here. What else do I want to do? Let's see. This is the purple. There's purple shadows in this picture, so I'm just kind of going with that. Get the purple down, go over it with white, and make it a little brighter. Let's see how that Chinese white blends. And that blends pretty good. I don't know if this is really how interesting this is for you guys, but I'm hoping that it'll show you to try, you know, just try some things. Needs a head scratch. <laughs> I know this is all based in. I need to, you know, you got to do... Uh, and maybe I just took on too much trying to do two alpacas in a day, right? <laughs> you probably shouldn't try to do two alpacas in a day. What the? Cats are out there having a party outside my door. Okay, so that's based in so I can go on top of that. But I really want to get their little faces in. But the color, guys, I'm oh, so sorry. I know, maybe I should brighten it up again. I moved to white paper, so I got used to adjusting everything on the white paper. And then I go over here to a brown paper. And it's like, what? Okay, let's do this little nose here. Hang on, let's do Let's try to get this in here quick. Can we do it quick?
I'm not watching chat. I should be watching chat. What's the best movie y'all have seen lately? Have y'all watched any movies lately that y'all have really liked? Such good work. Had to show. Oh, thanks, Robin. That was nice. Hello, Robin's hubby. Y'all watched any movies lately? Anything good? Gone, not even necessarily gone to the movies. A Star is Born. How was that? You mean the new, the new one you're talking about, right? Okay, I'm going to have to go. I'm going to have to keep moving on here. I'm going to spend too much time detailing. Too much time detailing. Real Player, The Commuter, Crimes of Crimes of Grindelwald. Robin goes, I read a book. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. I guess you would have, Robin. You're a you know, book reviewer. See, and then this is where you would want to do nice, soft, little, you know, like here's his little, here's coming this way. And he's got, this has to be. A sci-fi movie. Okay, what was it, Charles? I mean, unless that was one I named. Oh, Charlotte. I'm sorry. Hi, hi, Colleen. No, they're not kitties. They are alpacas. <laughs> oh. Let's just let's get this let's get this done here. Let's get her get her done. I don't know what Janet's tweeting, but she just said she was the boss of the world. Good for you, Janet. Good for you. <laughs> I just saw it pop up on my uh, on my iPad. I, it's it's uh, muted, but I just saw it pop up. Janet goes, "I'm the boss of the world." Our friends have no lack of confidence, do they? None of us really do. We have lack of confidence. I'm going to have to stop, guys. I'm not going to get, I'm not going to finish this. <laughs> I need to work on the other one for a minute. Oh, wait. Julie said, I have a recommendation for documentary on Netflix, The Struggle, The Life and Lots Art of Oh, I'm not going to be able to pronounce his name. His name, her name. Yeah, what's it about, um, uh, Julie?
Okay, I'm going to stop on him, guys. Um, let me get a little. Mm -mm, no, no purple. A sculptor. Oh, you're welcome, Terry. You gotta go. Let me uh, give you a send off, Terry. <laughs> oh, where's my phone? Oh, where is it? Here we go. I'm gonna give Terry a send off. Um, turn my volume back up. Okay. go <laughs> it's a sculptor uh sukowski sukowski you're welcome <laughs> all right let's see you guys let me let me uh yeah i'm messing around too much guys I'm, i mean i'm gonna admit it i'm not i'm not doing a lot of concentrating <laughs> i'm not just having fun hanging out with you guys today let's do a little bit of light here All right, we're going to move on. We're going to move on. <laughs> and he's got little, let's go ahead and just, you know, for the for the fun of it, let's go ahead and throw him in a couple of whiskers there. <laughs> I don't have anything done on his fur, anything really done up here in his, uh, um, ears. All right, let's move on from him. Let's move over to let's move over to this one. What can we do for a minute? I really wanted to work on my uh, lionfish today. That ain't happening, is it? Lionfish, that's not happening. We're gonna pretend. We're gonna pretend we're in the wild. We're out. And we're in nature, and we have to do this fast. <laughs> we're gonna call it just a sketch. Gotta get all that fur around the eyes. <gasps> oh, no time, no time. I'm melting. I'm melting. <laughs> There's a gray. <laughs> this is fun to hang out with you guys. Not everything has to be finished. Something finished and something, um, yeah. I mean, it doesn't for me. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry, guys. The lighting's really throwing me here. Um, but whatever. It's really throwing me. Looking at the camera. 
I don't know how bad it really is. I'll go back and look at it later. Okay, so there's some... Uh, I'm going to get back in there with my paint. Out in the wild. Yes, out in the wild. Yeah, if you were out, if you were on a safari, <laughs> you know, don't we do that all the time? Don't we do that all the time? <laughs> Turning into a hot mess. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's just basic. I'm not going to have time to do the details. <laughs> Should do a spoof of this, but alpacas would look like the Yeti and the Bigfoot. This one's a little further along. I'm not going to have time, guys, to get this one done. I mean, let's just face it. It's just, you know, I'm, I'm going to be rushing. I'm not, and obviously have not even started on my haven't even started on my lionfish. Ugh. All right, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop while I'm not happy. <laughs> we might work on it again another day. Okay. <clears throat> I do like this guy's little face. I do like his little face. Oh, now the color comes in. Oh my gosh. So there, he's his little color. He needs detail. Color doesn't look bad. Yeah, well, you know. I guess I'm just thinking more about my uh, lionfish. So let's move this. Let's put a fresh piece of paper. Let's move that. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my. I want to look at my lionfish. Can you tell when I got one thing on my mind? <laughs> They're all right. All right. So let's see here. I want to do my lionfish because I want to ink and I want to ink him. Let's see. I got a multitude of those. Which I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine lionfish pictures to choose from. Which one do I want to look at? Kind of like this one for a start. Hmm. Kind of like that one. Okay, I think I'll just go with this one. I think I've actually drawn this one before. All right. All right. I'm going to draw here. <laughs> All right, let me clean my hands. Thanks, newbie. That's all right. You know, for a quick, I like the brown one. I just, it's take, I know how long it's going to take to do fur. I know how long it's going to take to do fur. And I don't want to spend an hour on the fur. So we're moving on. <laughs> okay. All right. What do I want to draw with? What do I want to draw with? I don't know if you'll be able to see his blue pencil. Because um, I want him big. All right, let me see if how far I'm backed out. Okay, now let's move the camera back over here. Big white space. Oh, come on. Okay. My granddaughter's message and me. Hang on, guys. Okay. The brown one is cute. Yeah, well, the, the white one will look cute, too, when I finish it. All right, let's see. Do I want to draw in... Because um, I want to ink it. So you probably are not going to see it. It's a thing. 
well, we'll see. Let's, let's give it a go. Because here's my idea. Here's the idea I want to do. I want a big, giant, I want a big, giant um, lionfish. Oh, see, you're not, well, I want a big, giant lionfish and a sea scene. So give me a minute. We'll see how much we can see here. I want a big, giant The um, lion. Lionfish. Can you see anything? Maybe, maybe. I want to really fill the whole page. Propeller type wingy things here. I think I want to add some extra ones. I'm not sure how many there are there, but I want extras. Is anything showing up? Oh, yeah, it's showing up a little. Uh, I'm drawing a lionfish. I want um, more little horn things there. Remember when we did the jellyfish um, octopus? But I just drew that straight with ink. We didn't even sketch it. We just drew it on that one. I'm making my fantasy here. Can y'all see? Ah! Come on now. Give me some space. I'm working on a big... I... Move the paper down. There we go. Oh, there's that paintbrush. <laughs> All right. I want to try. I want to try to ink some. Um, I'm gonna try to ink them a little bit. We'll see. Right now, I'm just trying to get them kind of sketched. Now I'm gonna kind of, uh, you know, I'm just kind of making them my own. I'm not trying to, you know. I think people think that every time you draw something, you have to have it like exactly like um, something that you see or that you're looking at. And, and I don't, I like to make, I like to make it my own, even though my alpaca needs more work. I'll probably work on it later. Maybe while I'm watching, you know, I don't know. I might be wanting to work on this because I'm liking my lionfish. Okay. So he's going to have kind of, And there's stripes. I think we've talked about this before. Their stripes come out from the same place as their um, spikes do. I think it needs a couple more spikes. 
So it's like the big stripes. Come out from. Sorry, guys, I'm not looking at chat. I'm trying to get him sketched in here. <clears throat> Hi, Nancy. Oh, I hope you're enjoying being here. I think it needs it. Just I'm gonna throw in an extra one of these. These could be some. I mean, I I can just make a whole story up about them. But uh, yeah, I'll do that in my head. <laughs> I want some more of these. I want another one of these. I want lots of fins. I don't know if that's how many they'd have, but I want lots of fins on mine. The smaller stripes up in here. Nice big eyeball. Something like this. Okay, sketched out. I like his little chunky little face there. Mm. All right, let's get some, let me get some uh, brush pens or something. Let's see what we can do. Ikea. All right. Not going to add any um, any color to him right now. But the idea that I had. Oh, wait. I know what else I need. I need some little striped fins back in here. I want this to be. I don't want to lose that. There's some little dots and things in here. I haven't seen it, newbie. I haven't seen it yet. I'm behind on any videos over the weekend, pretty much. Uh, all right, so let's see. Let's get me a test paper over here. Put this brush to this one. Oh, that will be more detail. Let's see. I probably should just get a. I should probably just get a. Uh, what do you call it? Ink. Oh, let's see. Let me find some ink up here. Oh, oh. I'm almost out of that. One. Let's get one that has more. Okay, I got to go around the table here. I'm just going to brush it and get myself. To start with, anyway. All right. This paper, this is a paper behind the paper. See, so. oh, you're welcome, Forever Purple. I hope you had fun. I hope you had fun. Okay, so I've got to kind of move this down toward me so that y'all can see the top, and we'll see what we can do here. I 
going to get them based in here. What's my name on PayPal? Oh, there you go. Pacola just put in a link. Thank you so much. If And guys, if you PayPal me, make sure you email me your address if you want some happy mail. Because um, it doesn't show unless you put it in. Okay, I got ink on something here. Oh, my gosh. Okay. See those little dots right there? I got it on something. It's probably on one of my bracelets. Okay. And I'm sorry I'm not talking a lot, guys. Oh, Melody? Melody. Melody, Miss Melody. You already do enough for... You already do enough for all of us. Just saying. I'm just going to get this blocked. I'll go back in with details. And I want it like, I don't want it too perfect. I don't want this too perfect. I want these lines to be kind of straight here because that it's like, I don't know. I imagine them could be like antennas. <laughs> I like the antennas of the sea world. What, what am I digging my brush into? <laughs> it's just some ink and a little soap, so, soap stone tray. It's one of these little, like, here's a bigger one. It's these little soap stone um, that they're made to grind your ink. You know, you can buy the ink sticks and grind them yourself. I don't do that. I just pour the ink in, in these. And, uh, yeah, I'm just using, just using ink poured in into the little soapstone. It's just easier to roll your brush in. You probably can't see it. So I'm just rolling my brush in the ink like that. It's got a little bit of a dip to it, a little bit of an angle. <laughs> okay, so let's see. <clears throat> Dad used to sharpen mom's kitchen knives with soapstone.
I just wanted to do this today, guys. I don't know why. I just felt like it. This was this was on my mind while I was doing the alpaca. Thought you were really concentrating then. <laughs> oh, Lisa. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, but, uh, yeah, whichever. I mean, I could, you know, I could have stayed longer and done the other one. The uh, the other alpaca, the white one. But I'm going to, you'll see, I'm going to have it finished. And you're going to go, oh, yeah, that looked, that turned out really good. Should have finished it on, on camera. <laughs> I'm doing I'm kind of doing the thicker lines right now and I'll go back in and do the thin like detail. I'm just kind of blocking it in. I'm just I'm just having fun guys. Not everything has to be you know, but I've just kind of imagined I kind of imagined like a sea world, if you will. With lionfish. Then I'll probably want to go, oh, yeah, I think I want to put color in it. Might be today. We did a blue fit. We did one of these in blue one time or turquoise a, while, a few years ago. Okay, I think I want one more fin here. Did it? I think we did it in acrylic paint. I don't remember. Jean, what? What are you going to do with the UT today? The uh, embossing powder? What are you going to do? Oh no, I almost want to get my markers out. Do I want to get my markers out? <laughs> Do I want to get my markers out? You're welcome, Great. Thanks for being here. Oops, got that one a little... Do a little thicker right there. That's where it's going to be thicker anyway. I don't really want a definitive line there with this thick, but much thinner. Of course, I want to get my marker. Christine, you pop in, Christine, long enough to tell me to get my markers out. <laughs> you guys. 
Get the markers out. Again, this is, I want these thin things here to be very thin on the edges here, so. <laughs> you, I'm going to see if you can recreate some of Seth. Oh, Seth Aptors. I didn't see, I mean, I saw the video popped up on the, on the to watch thing. Um, yeah, I, is that what you're talking about? I didn't watch it, Jean, but I saw it pop up on the, uh, I saw it pop up on the to watch screen at Creative Vision or what's it called again? I keep wanting to say Creative Vision. That's not right. Is that what you're talking about? The videos where he's doing it, uh, his ink projects. Oh, um, or oh, was he in the Wanderlust? Oh, so you're just following a Wanderlust project then, not from the, not from the, what do you call it, from the Create Vision? What is it called? Why am I keep saying Create a Vision? This is his back, right? I don't want to draw a harsh line on his back. Two different things. Okay. What is it called again, guys? Not creative vision. What is it? Where the, the craft show thing is going on? Where Shannon Green is at, creative, creative, creativation, creativation. Thank you, Zeely. Yeah, creativation. <laughs> so, and yeah, don't forget, guys. Maybe she'll come on early. When I, if I leave in about fifteen minutes, maybe we can get Janet to come on early and start selling her stamps. <laughs> okay let's see i think it's gonna need some kind of a fin let me pencil that in you need some kind of a fin back here i don't know if he has one back there but it looks kind of naked without a fin back there i'm gonna put one i don't i don't know if he has a fin back there or not something back there there's some kind of there's some kind of fin fin action going on back there behind the these things right there. And I gotta be careful not to pull this off in my lap. That would be bad news pulling that off into my lap. <laughs> Janet, you have bought stamps. She hasn't bought stamps for 95 years, unless she's including her mother's collection. Her mother to collect, she, her mother had an awesome collection of stamps. Okay, there's a, there's my start. There's my blocking in. There's my blocked in lionfish. <laughs> See, now I'm going to start getting in here now. I don't think I'm going to get out the markers. Let me go ahead and do some black. What's Eileen saying? We could have a black and white lionfish. Doesn't have to be orange, does he? I, need, I should leave a little space there for a light spot right there. Oops, sorry guys.
I should do some of this tiny bits later. But I want to remember that I want this in there. Oh, thanks, guys. Yeah, well, you know, we're just trying different. We just like to do different things. <laughs> and we don't get bored around here. No boredom around here. I'm the boss of my lionfish. <laughs> oh, I know, right? Reminds me of Inktober. So I don't do much inking except during Inktober. <laughs> you know, that's usually when I do my, any ink is in Inktober. And I want them really stripey. I'm, I'm actually doubling the amount of stripes in these fins. I'm actually putting twice as many because I like them. Because like you said, we're the boss of our lionfish. This one needs to be curved. I have to fix that maybe. Maybe. <clears throat> no one sent me a program how the heck am I supposed to get with it <laughs> oh my gosh Janet oh my god oops I got a blob on there <laughs> now do I want even more, do I want stripes? I don't know. Let me just wait on that. So I'm not sure how I want those stripes to be. We're making this up as we go along. Jen, how many actually, in, in really and truly, Jen, how many stamps do you have that you're going to sell about? Do you know? I mean, have you counted, guesstimated? <clears throat> I'm waiting for Janet to answer. Thanks, Kathy. Hi, Joey. It's almost the rules. It's against the rules to count. No clue. You're happy in your dementia. <laughs> so you're just going to, you know, you need an auctioneer there. Now, that's one thing that I'd have to really listen to an auctioneer to imitate, you know. Okay, so let's. I gotta have some a little thicker here. Gonna have some because I'm gonna get them all to to the same. I don't want them the same. <laughs> I need to do. I need to get in here. With, I could do this much quicker with the with the brush. I think or the uh, thin thin brush marker. 
they'd probably do it quicker, but I'm just having fun with it. <laughs> These should be called what, what, tiger fish, right? Yeah, because of the stripe. Well, I'm adding lots more stripes than they, they have. I'm, make, I'm making my own. <laughs> making it much more stripey. Much more stripey than he really is. Yeah. I'll do all those thin things in a little bit. I want to get this kind of blocked in here. I don't, I'm really making them kind of too symmetrical. I should just kind of be skipping around here and putting maybe a couple of extra little lines in there. And I'll go back with the detail. I mean, there's only so much you can do in 30 minutes, right? <laughs> you only can sketch a lionfish and ink them so fast in 30 minutes. I mean, there's only so fast we can go. <laughs> I'm the boss of my fish. If I'm coming on early, I need to get go, get it up. Well, go, Janet, go, girl. You, if if they want you to come on early, you better do it. You know how these girls are. You know how they are. You better get. You better go now, Janet. <laughs> go get those stamps. Go get those stamps out. I want to go too. I got to go make me something to eat though. I don't eat till after my stream. So I have to go grab something to eat. So don't start the auction with, <laughs> don't start the auction. Give me five minutes after the show, Janet. <laughs> Bye, Charlotte. Thanks for being here. Okay. So let's see here. I need some more thinking. I, need some more thinking. I really want this closer, but that's dangerous putting it on there. It really is dangerous because, you know, you need, can splot it you don't really want to put it on there but <clears throat> I just had coffee and banana over raisin toast. Yum. You're welcome, Eileen. You better go and get make sure Janet's set up, Eileen. I'm gonna be leaving here in a minute. <laughs> I'm gonna be I'm just gonna pull I'm gonna get a little bit more of these stripes on here. Yeah, Jan, Janet won't start the auction without you guys. J uh, Eileen, are you gonna be the auctioneer over there? Typing like an auctioneer? I want to see that. <laughs> Eileen, I want to see you type out like an auctioneer would talk. Can you do that? I gotta get all these thin ones in here, but I don't have time to do all of them right now. <laughs> I want them wavy. I don't want them straight. I want them all kind of. No way. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. Be a sport, Eileen.
Put some two or three thin ones in between the thick ones there. This would be fun to color. Uh oh. Uh oh. Little, little crusty bit right there. Yep. You got your PayPal's out ready for Janet's auction. I guess I should quit, huh? What all kinds of little little lines in between these thicker ones. to be very lion-esque. Then in the in these tails, uh, in the fins, they have these dots going down the fins, like tiny little dots. Jan will have this so confusing. You want me? To, oh, I need to go over there and help. Good grief. I guess I'm going to have to get over there. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm going to get my little eyeball in there. All right, guys, I guess I'll head out so we can go to Janet's and watch her silly auction. I say silly because of how it's going to go, not because of what she's selling is silly. <laughs> so then all these are going to need, these are going to need stripes going across them too. They're a little thicker. But I don't want them perfect. They're not, they're not, they're not just lines. They're more, you know, shaped things like I mean get your get your gavel ready <laughs> exactly Eileen get your gavel ready <laughs> All right, we'll see. This one's kind of facing this way. <laughs> they don't they don't line up though. They're like opposite of each other. So let's put them in between. These thicker ones. <laughs> So thanks, everybody, for being here. Thanks for all the thumbs up. This one's kind of, let's give this a little foreshortening. Um, thanks, everybody, for being here, giving me all the thumbs up. Come in. I'm almost done um, streaming. I didn't finish my lionfish, but... Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Oh, well, honey, it's just a 30 minute sketch. That took me 30 years to do that. <laughs> so, anyway, the girls are getting ready to go to Janet's. Janet's going to sell some of her stamps off. Mm -hmm. So, we're going to go over to Janet's and watch Eileen uh, have a gavel. Oh, that, oh, look what I did there. It's, remarkable. Thanks, honey. So, you come in and I do a crooked line. <laughs> It's okay. Oh, no, it's okay. That's <laughs> okay. I'm going to uh, come down and get something to eat real quick right. and uh, then go to Janet's. Let me turn on the coffee for you. Oh, did you make me some coffee? Okay. You're the sweetest one. Thanks to Malibu. Yeah, Malibu and Oliver. 
Okay. All right, guys, I'm going to stop. I'm going to, I'll probably work on it while I'm at Janet's. <laughs> I'm glad y'all had fun. <laughs> if I had a gavel, I'd be knocking Janet on that. Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I will see you guys over at Janet's. Thanks for being here, guys. It was fun. Even though only one of our two alpacas got any dent in them. I mean, a little bit of paint on them. Bye, guys. <laughs>